crafty. Megan hits the ceiling after Thomas Markle discloses naked truth about her $4.99 salad bar. Megan's father has scotched her claims she grew up on salads at a budget restaurant. Thomas Markle, 77, also called Harry a candy ass, a timid or cowardly person, for quitting the UK. Meghan tried to highlight her humble roots to push for paid parental leave by saying in a letter to US politicians in October she grew up on the $4.99 salad bar at Sizzler family restaurants. But Thomas, speaking from his home in Rosarito, Mexico, told the son, she's never, ever, ever had to worry about anything like that in her life. We do the best restaurants in town and we do Sizzler because it was convenient. We never had to rub our pennies together and just have the salad bar. She had the salad bar, but she had a meal as well. He added of Meghan's note, she sends letters to senators and congressmen where she calls herself the Duchess. That's totally wrong. You really shouldn't do that. Thomas also took aim at Harry, 37, for quitting as a frontline royal. He said, Harry walked away from his responsibilities and that's ridiculous. He walked away from his grandmother, the royals and the British people. He's a candy ass. I'd take him on at my age any time. He'd run away from me. Last week, the Court of Appeal upheld a ruling that the publisher of the Mail on Sunday breached Meghan's privacy by reproducing a letter she wrote to her dad after marrying Harry in 2018. Thomas told The Sun, I got really upset at the judgment because that means I still can't tell my story and defend myself. I thought there would be a fair trial but now it's not going to trial. It's ridiculous. The British system has let me down. Unless it's stamped private on top of the letter, how can it be private? It doesn't make sense to me. If that's British law I don't know how anyone can get by. Thomas is now considering going on YouTube to read the unpublished parts of Meghan's letter to him. He added, someday that letter's going to be released. I still love my daughter but I hate what she's become. She's changed so much. Last week, Thomas Markle accuses Meghan Markle for helping in his unfair treatment. He accused the royal family and the Sussexes of owing him. He was also quoted saying, at this point, they owe me. The royals owe me. Harry owes me, Meghan owes me. What I've been through, I should be rewarded for. My daughter told me that when I reach my senior years she'll take care of me. I'm in my senior years now, it's time to look after daddy. During the course of his interview, Mr. Markle also claimed that his unfair treatment within the media is what propelled him to create this documentary, all because I want everyone to know that I'm not all the trashy things that are being said about me. He also went on to say, I want Harry and Meghan to see this video and know that this is not fair. Meghan addressed her father's betrayal for the first time during a bombshell interview with Oprah Winfrey in March. She admitted their relationship hadn't recovered after he pulled out of her wedding due to health problems, before admitting to staging paparazzi photos and leaking information to the press. If we are going to use the word betrayal, it's because when I asked him, when we were told by the comms team, this is a story that was going to be coming out, we called my dad and we asked him, Meghan said. I said, you know, the institution has never intervened for anything for us, but they can try to go in and kill this story. But if they do this once, we're not going to be able to use that same leverage to protect our own kids one day. She said she told Thomas that if he admitted to colluding with photographers that they could help him, but that he wasn't able to do that, 